Hey people, it's me, Karen Lee, here again with the Tower Garden and Inspiration Farms. I wanted to tell you a little bit about the yield of the Tower Garden and the nutritional value. So there was a study done at University of Mississippi and they planted um, crops in the ground and crops in the tower at the same time. They were eight different vegetables and herbs that they planted. And the results of their study showed that the nutritional value in the tower garden versus the nutritional value of the same exact crops grown in the ground was greater in the tower garden or equal to that which was grown in the soil. So I think that's really cool. Great nutritional value, greater than or equal to what's grown in the ground. The other thing that they studied was the yield, and they found out that the yield was greater in the tower garden for every single crop. Um, the average uh, greater yield was 30% greater in the tower garden, and I'll tell you specifically some of the crops and what the yield was. Um, with red kale, it was 65% greater yield in the tower garden. With bell peppers, 53% greater yield in tower garden. With squash, 50% greater yield in tower garden. With cherry tomatoes, 35% greater yield in the tower garden. Parsley, 21% greater yield in tower garden. Basil, 19% greater yield in tower garden. Chard, 8% greater yield in tower garden. And cucumbers, 7% greater yield in tower garden. That's pretty amazing, isn't it? All of those crops that they looked at, the, the yield was better in the tower garden. And, um, I think that's pretty amazing. If it's yielding more food and it's growing faster, mine, like I said, grows about twice as fast as my in-ground garden. Why wouldn't you want to have this in your yard, right? <laughs> it's super cost effective too. So if you're um, spending $12 a week right now at the grocery store or the farmer's market or wherever it is that you buy your produce, you could buy a tower garden and it would pay for itself in one year or less, depending on how many... Um, plantings you do depending on what crops you plant and um, the cost effectiveness is very impressive with the tower garden also depends on how many people are in your family and how much produce you guys are eating but basically if you're spending twelve dollars right now every single week at the store or the farmers market and who isn't on produce um, this tower will save you money over the long run. And it's super simple and it's super fun and kids absolutely love it. I can't express to you enough how much kids love this. They're putting these in schools all across the country. They're putting them in the boys and girls clubs. They're putting them in nursing homes so people in wheelchairs can wheel right up to their um, tower gardens and continue gardening. They're putting them in restaurants. They're putting them all over in ballparks, AT&T Ballpark in San Francisco has several tower gardens, so now you can have healthy food at the ball game. You don't necessarily need to eat a hot dog. Yay! Um, so yeah, that's what I have to tell you about the nutritional value and the yield and a little bit about how cost-effective it is. I hope that helps you, and I hope you have a beautiful day. Bye now.